Captain, people are afraid. That's why I'm here. We need to be put in check. Whatever form that takes, I'm game. I'm sorry, Tony. If I see a situation pointed south, I can't ignore it. Sometimes I wish I could. Sometimes I want to punch you in your perfect teeth. You know, the response to Civil War has been so positive. We just, we're, we're really, it makes us all the more excited to see it again. I mean, just look at a, look, look at a night like this. I mean, you see how many people come out and how enthusiastic they are. Yeah, there's just a lot of energy, you know? You're kind of taking it all in and it's, you know, this is what we do it for. It's cool to be a part of a franchise that's really good. It's a little bit like, uh, you know, you play a sport and then you, and then you get traded or, or, or drafted by the, by like Super Bowl champions. The safest hands are still our own. Look, it has heart, uh, you, you, you care about everybody, you're definitely conflicted at the end of the film and, as to who you should be rooting for, uh, and it has some, uh, some of the best action sequences you've ever seen in a, in a superhero movie. It's not often, if ever, you go into a movie knowing that the final product is going to be really good. It really is about the ideologies between our two biggest characters, who we've seen together in multiple films, who we met in their own films, and in this film it all comes to a head. This family that we call the Avengers, they get into a fight with each other. There's a really critical issue uh, that attacks the identity of the Avengers in the film. The most important thing to us as filmmakers was to make sure that when you got to the end of the film, that you could walk out of the theater and argue with your family and your friends about who was right and who was wrong. That conflict is what brings the movie to a higher level. The more, the more uncertainty you have with whose side you choose is what makes the film rich. I think the way these characters are written, much credit to Stan Lee, you know, he made them personable, he made them human. No, the work that Marvel is doing, the movies they are producing are so wonderful. They're good for youngsters, they're good for oldsters, men, women, everybody loves them.